Hey traders, welcome to the day trading recap for day trade ideas, January 26th, 2023. Let's take a look at what we did today. So bullish day, um, we did a lot on the SPX, which was nice. And uh, we had a lot of individual names that we were grabbing on the dips this morning. So we had a nice little, uh, you know, a bunch of trades that we went went about. Um, let's start off the equity side, guys. Tesla long out the gate three points um, this morning, and then we had it for one and a half points this afternoon on those ideas there. MLGO, a uh, nice one point trade on that one intraday. Pretty decent uh, move there. SHW, long idea this morning for seven points off the lows after it held support. Nice little trade there. Now long this morning for 15 points and change to the upside. We also did do some options on that. We'll talk about that uh, on those ideas after. MRNA, long off the lows for one point uh, on this little bounce here. Boop. Oh, wow, I didn't even realize it got continuation. I went back into that idea. Oh, well. Uh, and then uh, Tesla round two, like I said, one and a half points. We had a couple things that didn't work on the equity side. This uh, SNX, it actually just stayed flat. Um, you know, it 101.80. It ended up at like 102, whatever. I counted as didn't work because it didn't really go anywhere. So that one I counted as a fail. And then we had some uh, HCMP for a two cent loss. So that was nothing really. Off the lows, I should have held that a little bit longer. It would have, you know, got, would have been able to sell into that little pop there. But uh, other than that, that's it on the uh, the option side. Oh, Saba, Saba was the uh, the one that didn't work today. So shorted it at twenty seven forty. Got you know had to take take it off twenty eight forty. Um, obviously, you know, just stayed in the range, and that's it. Um, so all in all, pretty decent in that regard. Equity side, or sorry, option side, a little bit better. Uh, SPX 415, 410 put spread idea leg into 2,000%. Amazon 96 calls 537% on that idea overnight. Uh, CRM 165 calls, <coughs> sorry guys, 211% on that idea. Now 460 calls 170%. That actually ended up going up a little bit higher at the end of the day there, about 230%. Uh, Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, the two puts on the news that came out and uh, those ended up going 166%. Those are next week puts as well on that idea. And then EMPH, last but not least off the lows, 210 calls for 105%. There's a couple other things like we had uh, PDD on for over 100%. It was like 130%. Uh, PA&W for over 100%. Uh, we had this meta on for about 20%. And, uh, XOM calls. Ended up going back up. We were in them this morning. They ended up pushing back up 70% on those. Meta, we talked about that. LMT, 75%. Zoom ended up being about a 30% trade this morning. Actually, no, sorry, 70% trade this morning. And then PayPal was one that didn't work on the, uh, the option side there. So all in all, fairly high hit rate. I'm pretty happy with it. We'll see what happens tomorrow. Market's very forgiving. It's stair-stepping higher. I'm looking for a continuation to the upside tomorrow. So tomorrow's Lotto Friday. If you guys want to come trade with us, you can certainly do so. Go to sparrowtrading.com. You can sign up there. Any questions, reach out there. Reach out on Twitter. I'm happy to help, guys. Have a good one. Enjoy the rest of your day, and we'll talk to you later.